Today on MTG Unpacked, it's time for a double dose of chaos. That's right, these are my vision for how a chaos mystery box should be. So let's introduce the patron we have, Gav. Thank you for being a patron, sir. And unless I'm mistaken, this is episode 100 of the chaos boxes. I really didn't think we would run this long. Um, they don't get terribly many views, but you know what? I'm happy to keep doing them as long as the patrons still want them. All right, so let's roll one through three, four through six, then we'll narrow it down. So we have five, okay, second row, one through four. It is number two, okay, so that is your first one. And guess what? Gav is actually after two of these things. So we're going to roll one through six. It is number three. Okay. So I'm running out of space to put these things. Let's sort of off screen here. Pop them right there. Okay. So let's get into it. Thank you for being a patron, Gav. And the theme this month is the Zendikar Expedition. So we have some spicy stuff indeed here. So I hope you enjoy the video. All right, so first pack, Modern Horizons, Oath of the Gatewatch, Core 2021. Aha, uh -huh. there is the first expedition. Battle for Zendikar, Guilds of Ravnica, and Throne of Eldraino. So let's do things like so. You know what? I'm going to have these Battle for Zendikar and that will do that last there before the Modern Horizons. Okay, let's take a look at this spicy expedition. And in case you've been living under a rock, the expeditions are coming back in Zendikar Rising in the Collector Boosters. All right, there we are. And also box toppers for non-foil versions. So this is Cascade Bluffs. Tap to add colors mana to your mana pool. Pay blue or red. Tap add two blue, a blue and red, or two red to your mana pool. And it's a mythic. Okay, so there we are, Gav. There is expedition number one. Let's get into the next one here. Throne of Eldraine and the patrons get the rares, mythics, foils, and anything over a buck. <clears throat> Starting off with so tiny. Bajin, Ardenvale Paladin, Misford River Turtle, Fell the Pheasant, Memory Theft, Rose Thorn Halberd, Tempting Witch, Gingerbread Cabin, Stillgaze Griffin, and the Uncommons, Mystical Dispute, that is a nice one, I'll throw that in, Mysterious Pathlighter, Sir Conrad the Grim, and the rare is Happily Ever After, Enchantment for 3, so when it ends better fooled. Yeah, when it enters battlefield, each player gains five life and draws a card. Beginning of your upkeep, if there are five colors among permanents you control, there are six or more card types among permanents you control and or cards in your graveyard. And your life total is greater than or equal to your saying life total. You win the game. That is an awful lot of legalese there. And a swamp and night token. Okay, on to some guilds. And if you missed the crazy video last week, holy cow, there were ridiculous pulls. Oh, Chuck a link in the corner to that one. Absolute craziness. And if you like Zendikar Expeditions, hint, hint. All right, next up we have Ledev Guardian, Disdainful Stroke, Barging Sergeant, Pax Favor, Demir Locket, Centaur Peacemaker, Darkblade Agent, Devious Cover Up, Erstwhile Trooper, with a split card, Integrity and Intervention. Plague Crafter, good for battle, and the rare is Erratic Cyclops, a bit like the pools in this video. Creature Cyclops Shaman 0, 8 for 4 with Trample whenever you cast an instant or sorcery spell. Erratic Cyclops gets plus X plus 0 until end of turn, where X is that spell's converted mana cost. And a foil, Grappling Sundu, the Golgari Gilgate. And Elf Knight token. Okay, on to Core 2021. All right, pull tab here. So, guessing these, yep, printed in Japan. Okay. 
All right, so we've got MTG Arena, Scoured Barons, Anrea is Sporeweb Weaver, Creep Spider 1, 4 for 3, has Reach, Hexproof from Blue, whenever Sporeweb Weaver is dealt damage, you gain one life, and create a 1-1 one, one green, Sapling Creature Token. And Uncommon's Angelic Ascension, Sanctum of Shattered Heights, Liliana's Devotee, and the common Short Sword, Mask, Blackguard, Track down, capture sphere for all your Pokemon needs. Concordia, Pegasus, Legends, Judgment, Cancel, Goblin, Wizardry, Finishing, Blow, and Lenore, Visionary. Alright, on to BFZ. I hope you don't get terribly hosed, Gav, from this one like I have on many occasions. Okay, we have Mind Raker, Creature Eldrazi, Processor, Territorial Bailoth. Clutch of Currents, Calastria Nightwatch, Shore Strike, Kite Sail Scout, Gideon's Reproach, Touch of the Void, Sheer Drop, Kuzlex Channeler, Uncommon Serene Steward, Royal Spout, Retreat to Hagra, and rare is Planar Outburst, Sorcery for 5, Destroy All Non-Land Creatures, has Awakened 4, so for 5 and 3 white, if you cast this spell for 5 and 3 white, also put 4, plus 1, plus 1 counters, on target land you control and it becomes a zero zero elemental creature with haste it's still a land so it's a bunch of stuff like that coming back in zendikar rising get a nice forest and eldrazi scion i'll chuck that in as well onto oath of the gate watch so let's see how we do here this has been a pretty good box so far actually we've got ondu war cleric cultivator drone expedite Slaughter Drone, lead by example, Untamed Hunger, Tar Snare, Cinder Hellion, Unknown Shores, Gravity Negator, and yes, every uncommon in this box is upside down, not sure what's up with that. Prophet of Distortion, though the right way up at least, on the other side, Gift of Tusks, Malakir Soothsayer, and upside down, what's it going to be? Hissing Quagmire, land, enter spade field, tap, tap it for black or green. For one, black and green, it becomes a 2-2 black and green elemental creature with death touch until end of turn, it's still a land. All right, and a mountain and night ally token. Okay, Modern Horizons, we are looking for Ren and Stimpy. I know I say this every episode, it's getting a bit old to be honest, but I would like to pull them at least once in this year, the remainder of this year. All right, we have a goblin token, non-foil. What I witch, yes, got it. Snow-covered island, and nice, that'll do. Prismatic Vista, it's a land tap, pay one life, sack it, search library for basic land card, put it onto battlefield, then shuffle your library. And that is not a consolation prize at all. First slivers chosen, Frostwalk Bastion. Conifer Worm and ah, Arkham's Astrolabe. Not sure what this is doing these days. I'll chuck that in. Fountain of Icor, Miraza Behemoth, Segovian Angel, Manowar, First Sphere Gargantua, Mother Bear, Reckless Charge, Wall of 1000 Cuts, and Eye Kite. Okay, so Gav, we are going to scoop all this stuff up and then we'll go on to box number two. And what do you think of the Chaos Boxes? Do you think they're a little bit better than the Walmart variety or about the same? I'm curious what you think. Okay, they cost a bit more though, unfortunately. All right, what do we have here? Modern Horizons, Oathgate Gatewatch, Mystery Booster, Spicy Tamale, and another Expedition, Battle for Zendikar, Guilds, and Ikoria. So, Let's do something, let's do that first. Do that here, here, and here. Yeah, that's a good ordering. Okay, let's take a look here for Gav. What is this spicy goodness? Canopy Vista enters the battlefield tap unless you control two or more basic lands. It's a mythic. Some very nice foiling on these indeed. All right, tuck that back in there very carefully. Okay, let's get into some BFZ, hoping to pull some more expeditions. <clears throat> we have Alter's Reap, <clears throat> Plummet, Coral Helm Guide, Maya's Malice, 
out number. Kite Sail Scout, Shatter Skull Recruit, Core Castigator, Sheer Drop, Hedron Blade, Uncommon's Grip of Desolation, Retreat to Coral Helm, Blighted Woodland, and Smoldering Marsh. Nice. Tap it for black or red, and Spade Full Tap Nurse Control, two more basic lands. Very nice island, and Knight Ally Token onto Ikoria. Okay, so this must be a US pack. Yep. Alright, we have Gust of Wind, Ferocious Tiger Gorilla, Checkpoint Officer, Humble Naturalist, Mutual Destruction, Far Finder, Coordinated Charge, Excavation Mole, Suffocating Fumes, Pouncing Shore Shark, Classic for the Uncommons. Jubilant Skybonder, Necropanther, and a Mythic, yes, full art, comic book style. They drop Apex of Thunder, 333, three, three, Legendary Creature Elemental, Dinosaur Cat, yes, you heard that right, people. Mutate for one and a white or blue and two red, flying and first strike. Whenever this creature mutates, you may cast target non creature card with command mana cost three or less from your graveyard without paying its mana cost. Very nice indeed, a foil, unexpected fangs, and windscarred crag, and human soldier. Still looking for the catbird token, alas. He has not come up very much lately. On to guilds. Okay, we've got a torch courier creature goblin, hunted witness, the dark and mesmerist, fearless halberdier, vigor spore worm, never happened. Direct current, is it locket or isn't it? Deadly visit, iron shell beetle, uncommon's night veil vale sprite, thoughtbound phantasm, world soul colossus, and rare is citywide bust. Sorcery for three, destroy all creatures with toughness four or greater. And then is it Gilgate? I'll refrain from that joke. And an insect, okay, on to some oath. I wonder if I'll say an oath if I uh, find something spicy in here. We have Spark Mage's Gambit, Core Sidemaster, Comparative Analysis, Loam Lava, Witness the End, Netcast the Spider, Core Sky Climber, Zeta's Commando, Creature Goblin, Archer Ally, Crumbling Vestige, Containment Membrane, and you know it's just got to be upside down. We have Cinder, Barons, Prophet of Distortion, and Storm Chaser Mage. What is this creepy thing? It is, oh, Mina, Mina and Dan Wildborn. I thought it was an Eldrazi for a second there. Legendary Creature Elf Ally, 4-4 four, four, for 4. You may play an additional land on each of your turns. That's pretty solid. Red and green, return land you control to its owner's hand. Target creature gains trample until end of turn. Okay. The Plains and Core Ally token onto Modern Horizons. Okay, you know what I want from here. Anything spicy is good actually. Uh, if we aim for Ren and Stimpy, then hopefully we'll get something just as good. Okay, Soldier, uh, no idea. Answered Prayers, all right. Snow Covered Swamp. Zalfarin Decoy Foil, a bit of a decoy card there, and a Mythic! Oh Gav, you are cleaning out this box! Urza Lord High Artificer, Legendary Creature Human Artificer 1 4 for 4, when Urza Lord High Artificer enters the battlefield, credit is Urza, Colorless Construct Artifact Creature Token with, this creature gets plus 1 plus 1 for each artifact you control, Tap an untapped artifact you control, add one blue for five, shuffle your library, then exile the top card until end of turn. You may play that card without paying its mana cost. Fantastic, Paul. And a carrion feeder, conifer worm, undead auger, and commons a regular cohort, spring bloom, druid, cave of temptation, rank officer, first sphere, gargantua, mother bear, enduring sliver, phantasmal form, and bow garden, dragon heart. Okay, one more pack, and I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up, hit the subscribe button for more Magic the Gathering unboxings, and be sure to tap the notification bell to be notified as soon as new videos are released. And if I miss anything out of here, I'll definitely chuck it in there. Uh, once I've done the editing, we have Expose Evil, Healing Hands, Riftwing Cloudscape, that's an interesting one, Wind Strider, 
Phyrexian Reclamation. I don't know if that's worth anything, but it looks cool. I'll chuck that in. Ancestral Vengeance. Curse of the Nightly Hunt. Frilled Death Spitter. Dragon Scale Boon. Sepling Migration. Pillory of the Sleepless. Mishra's Factory. And the rare is a Guilt Leaf Palace. As it comes into play, you may reveal an elf card from your hand. If you don't, Guilt Leaf Palace comes into play. Tapped. Tap to add black or green to your mana pool. And the second rare is Mind Shatter. Sorcery for X and two black target player discards X cards at random. A bit like Mind Rot, really. And a foil Susuke, son of Shishiro. Snake Warrior from Kamigawa Block. Okay, so there we are. Gav doing nicely with the crazy pulls today. Some nice mythics and that prismatic vista. Pop those in there. Hope everyone's staying safe and healthy out there. Thanks for watching and have a great day.